Hello, my name is Maria Trykova and in the next short video I'm going to show you the deep and life-changing transformation that coaching brought to one of my clients. We had uh, three sessions with just a small success. We were not moving as fast as he wanted to and uh, when I was preparing uh, for our fourth session I uh, found a script that uh, Margaret and her team posted in our support group and the script was I refuse to change. I felt for this client that consciously he wanted to change but unconsciously he didn't. It was dangerous for him to change. So when we met I suggested him that first we did this tapping. He started and what happened amazed me. For the first time he told me that he's feeling his emotions. He started to feel tightness in his chest, a tight pain, and that was his disappointment by himself. Himself. He was disappointed by himself. And uh, we cleared all that stuff. And at, when we cleared it, he told me that till now he used to believe that showing his emotions and even feeling his emotions is dangerous because he might seem vulnerable and other people might harm him. We cleared all that too and we were back to our process and we were doing the outrageous goal. He became more cooperative and uh, he told me that he believes it's totally impossible to reach his goal because he was not born in rich family, nobody taught him how to do this, nobody gave him the money, it's all on circumstances. No matter what he did he will not, and what he does, he will not succeed. And then I asked him if he knows other people who were born under similar circumstances, but somehow managed to succeed. He started to think about it and to count one, two, three. And after each count, I saw he started to feel more and more uncomfortable. <sighs> At the end, he said, quote, quote, who am I blaming? Of course, that I am responsible. This is just my excuse to not do anything and to not move forward. We finished the session and at the end he told me that he's broke and I broke his imaginable comfort. As a new coach, I felt bad. I gave him the homework, but he said that he needed some time to process what he just realized. I was about to ask for help in our support group from the more experienced coaches when he called me and told me that this is it, he is better now. He started to change his habits, he is thinking how he could reach his goal. And uh, I was so inspired to hear that. And I am inspired not only by the result, but the process itself. And I am so passionate about this. and. If you are also inspired, you can email me at maria at mariatrykova.com. I'm honored to have chosen this profession and greetings from Europe and from Bulgaria.